the Holy Spirit Church and KGB Prison. The Church of the Holy Spirit, Puha Vaimu Kirik in Tallinn, is a captivating gem tucked within the city's medieval old town, offering visitors both spiritual tranquility and a window into Estonia's rich history. Built in the 13th century, it's one of the oldest and most unique churches in Tallinn, blending Gothic and Baroque styles. The church's exterior is most recognizable for its striking wooden clock, dating back to the 17th century, the oldest of its kind in the city. Still ticking today, the clock serves as a reminder of Tallinn's deep connection to its medieval roots. Stepping inside, you're greeted by an intimate and warm atmosphere, with intricately carved wooden details that transport visitors back in time. Highlights include the beautifully crafted pulpit from 1597 and the colorful stained glass windows, which depict biblical scenes and saints. These features reflect the craftsmanship of Tallinn's medieval artisans, making it a treasure trove for art and history lovers alike. The Church of the Holy Spirit also holds immense cultural importance. In 1531, it became the first church in Estonia to hold services in the Estonian language, playing a pivotal role during the Reformation. This move marked a significant moment in Estonia's religious and cultural evolution as it shifted the focus from Latin to the local language, empowering the common folk and solidifying its place in Estonia's spiritual heritage. Today, the church remains active, hosting services, concerts and cultural events, preserving its legacy as a spiritual and community hub. It's truly a must-see for anyone exploring Tallinn. KGB Prison in Tallinn a grim reminder of Estonia's dark past. The KGB prison located at Pagari 1 in the heart of Tallinn is one of the most infamous remnants of Soviet repression in Estonia. Originally designed as a residential building, this unassuming structure became a symbol of terror during the Soviet occupations of Estonia, serving as the headquarters of the KGB, the Soviet Union's Committee for State Security. The prison is now a museum that offers visitors a stark and sobering look into one of the darkest chapters of Estonia's history, where countless political prisoners suffered under Soviet rule. The history of the KGB prison dates back to the tumultuous times surrounding World War II. Estonia, like many Baltic states, found itself caught between two aggressive superpowers, Nazi Germany and the Soviet Union. Estonia, like many Baltic states, found itself caught between two aggressive superpowers, Nazi Germany and the Soviet Union. In 1939, as a result of the Molotov-Ribbentrop Pact, the Soviet Union gained influence over Estonia and the other Baltic states, leading to the first Soviet occupation in 1940. It was during this time that the KGB, then known as the NKVD, began using the basement of Pagari I as a detention and interrogation center for suspected enemies of the state. The KGB prison was notorious for its brutal methods of interrogation and the inhumane conditions in which prisoners were kept. The basement of the building, where prisoners were held in small cramped cells, is a grim space that remains largely unchanged. Visiting the prison today, you can see the claustrophobic cells with thick reinforced doors devoid of any natural light or fresh air. The KGB prison in Tallinn is a haunting, yet necessary stop for anyone interested in the history of Estonia or the broader context of Soviet repression in Eastern Europe. The preserved cells, chilling stories and harrowing atmosphere serve as a powerful reminder of the human cost of authoritarianism and the resilience of those who fought for their country's freedom. A visit to this museum is a sobering and unforgettable experience, offering profound insight into one of the most painful chapters of Estonia's past.